Hi, my name is Janae Saunders and I am the School Compliance Associate at DCPCSB. As you all know, we will be transferring procurement contract submissions into the Hub starting August 1st, 2019. In this video, I will be showing you how to upload an exempt contract. The contract information that I will be using does not reflect real contract information and is only being used for training purposes. After you are in the procurement contract section of the Hub, on the left side of the screen, you will see a section called Submit Procurement Contracts. Please click on that to begin the submission process. Now you will see that there are tabs at the top of the page that you must click on to complete the submission process. Please click on these in order to make sure that all required documentation is uploaded. First, you can click on the drop down box to choose your LEA. Next, you will choose the contract type. For this exempt contract, we will be using utilities as our example. Now you can go to the next tab. Now you can select your vendor. If the vendor that you need is not listed here, you can scroll down to the bottom to create a new vendor. Now you can fill out the remaining fields. In the value section, you can either put a low value and a high value if you have a range, or you can put one value in both fields if you have an exact value. Please remember that for the award date, effective date, and expiration date, you must follow the year, month, and day format. Now that you've completed all of the tabs, you can click Save and Close. For exempt contracts, there aren't any bidding documents that need to be uploaded, so your submission is complete.